me dan ganas a veces de montarme a mi canoita nuevamente y recordar mi niñez y lo hago a esta edad. Tendría siete, ocho años cuando nosotros comenzamos a pescar aquí. Well, for a lot of people, certainly in the UK and Europe, um, Colombia still has a little bit of a, um, a feeling of the, the, the things that have gone before here. But actually now, Colombia is a wonderful country and it's safe and, uh, and it's got some fantastic fishing opportunities. de los tiburones que todo el mundo, los, los mayores que nosotros y todos sabíamos que el tiburón agresivo que teníamos en nuestro Pacífico era la tintorera. Pero cuando yo la veo que la tengo parqueada a, a cinco metros, pues en el momento yo pienso que voy a ser devorado por ella. la gallona, tenemos la burica, eh, la viuda, ubicaciones de calamar y todo eso viene del sur con las corrientes, principalmente cuando están con los corpos, llegan atunes gigantes de más de 100 kilogramos. Vallasolano tiene algo único, algo especial y es que la costa está respaldada por la selva en más de 200 millas, eso permite tener una reserva inmensa de aguas. And you need the right game, which, as I say, is, is long cast, and I mean long cast, very, very quickly. So don't come here if you can't double haul and you can't shoot a 12 weight line. There's so much going on all the time. There's sardines, there's just bait everywhere. There's these magnificent whale sharks that just pop up and say hello out of the blue and everybody rushes to the gunnel and, and, and looks down at these amazing creatures. It's full of life, it's pristine. It doesn't have that feeling that place has been ravaged by commercial fishing. Um, it's a wonderful place. Sepa la línea, sepa la línea, sepa la línea. 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 Sep
Ih! Oh, pesan apa ya, Ra? Wow, super big. Muy grande. Okay. That's the picture. That's the picture. Okay. Same picture again. <laughs> With the nap, you get this fantastic sight of this fish coming out and grabbing it right in front of your eyes. And while you're still processing what you've just seen, uh, so I gave Jose one of those flies. I saw the fish, I think, before he saw it. Uh, when it went down, it took so quick, it was a blur, but I saw that it was a very big fish. But when I saw that fish, I thought, ouch, that is, that's a world of pain. And Jose's a strong guy, he's a, he works out, he's, he's well built, he's strong, he's, he's a very experienced fisherman. Um, I don't want to say too many good things about him, but uh, he knows what he's doing. And yet he was, he only told me this afterwards, but he was close to giving up on that fish.